are you an anal man, period? Do you like that? You ever done it before? Um, I have. Uh, not very many times because most of the time it's just wasn't able to be successful with, you know, I, mm. you know, I won't get into why, but it, it ain't really that important. Mm-hmm. Really that important. No, I, I mean, because I guess since I was young, I just never been able to get, it's not like I never had anybody who said, okay, yeah, let's try this, but it just really wasn't able to get accomplished, you know, often at all. So are you sticking to one particular position for it or? Switching I've it tried, up. I've, I've tried different different positions. You so know, it's you. Per, the person it's that you, you was with. It's you then. Did they know, was it their first time? No. It's you. She, did she know how to guide you the way? Well, I mean, we talking about we stress. talking about different people though. You know uh, what I mean? But so you're the. I guess people man. say pain. And, mm-hmm. You know, pain is too much. I, I I ain't got I ain't got time for all of that shit. You got to make time. Huh? You gotta make time. I mean, if you tell me it hurts too much, you got time for that. If you tell me it hurts too much, you got time for that. You know, let, let's do that. Let's do that. You know what I'm saying? Last exploration takes time. If you tell me I, you don't eat peanut butter, I, I'll just put jelly on your damn bread. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> if you tell me it hurts too much, okay, let's move on. I don't, I'm not an expert at that, so I wouldn't know. Like, <laughs> Shouts out to Thorny Switch in the chat nah, room. I don't, I don't know. I What's don't up, know girl? Thank you for being here. Not to say that I've never got it accomplished, but it was not that many times. Mm. Mm. Well, what about you? What about yeah, you? Yeah, what about you? Hey, look at Are you are you an anal freak? <laughs> Do you spread those? You ever cheeks? you ever had anybody put anal beads inside of you? Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Anal beads are great, you guys. Like, yeah. I never you know, tried the anal beads. I you never. want to try them right now? No. No. <laughs> no. Hey, no. Now put know, it back you, on. No. You know, you know you normally got some <laughs> something out here too to describe for the audience, but you, you slipping today. But I'm not slipping. Nah, I know. I know. I know. I just put the toys up. How do the bees know? work anyway? You put them in. I heard about them. Well, it just depends because sometimes they have the beads on the string, mm-hmm. so they're you know free, moving free. And um, the ones that are on the plastic, you know, they're just in unison. You just kind of stick that thing in. But you just put them all in. It would be the same as if someone was tonguing your ass, kind of, you know, just stimulating you. So mm -hmm. I'm like, it can't feel the same. No, but I mean, how many beads come on the beads? It's like six, but they might start off small and work their, you know, their way up to being larger, or they might be the same size. So what about an anal plug? To yank it out. You ever try to anal Not plug? Not yank, but just pull it. Pull, pull yeah. it slowly. Yes, is the answer to your wow. question. You you had you had them before. I didn't have it, but believe me, I have seen it. Seen it. <laughs> She's seen it. <laughs> <laughs> wink, wink. Press the, uh, ring the bell. Ding ding. <laughs> wait, I'm getting to it. Oh my god. Okay, wait. We got a couple different people in the chat room that we miss, Mister Microwave. Well, hey, yes. hey, look, man, y'all, y'all. Are you on the clock, okay? You on the clock? Distracted. You on the clock? Okay, so, but anal beads, though, very pleasurable. It does take some time, and I always recommend that people do the necessary things to take care of themselves first before inserting the beads. You know, because some people walk around with them all day, so that when yes, they see their 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 partners, they they've got a special surprise for them, and it may be more than what they bargained for. So, but yeah, usually I have the beads and things out, Mister Microwave. In the building. Where is Mr. Mandelion? He's in the building. Where is he? He's in the shot room. Shouts out to Mr. Mandelion. I don't see him. Where is he? You don't see him? Oh, there he is. He's my star. He's my star. What's up, Mr. Mandelion? Hey, go, go I want to know go when the bees pull out, what do they smell like? <laughs> Wait, what? What do you think the bees are going to smell like? <laughs> I mean, be for serious. You know what they smell like. They smell like ass, dude. You know, Ooh. so I'll say this. When you... Whoever you are, man or woman, because both both parties do it. You know, if you take the necessary precautions, you can, you know, avoid all of that extra. You can. And it can also smell great. As long as you don't do it on a day when you know you're loose back there. Right. Right. Take care of you first. Oh, you mean like diarrhea? Yeah. If you know you don't have that earlier today, don't try the beast and don't try it. You need to cleanse yourself. Like, anytime, even before sex. If I I don't know if I'm going to have anal sex or not, but I prepare myself in the event of, you know, like... Just in case. Like, I'm going to make sure. How you prepare yourself for that? Well, you know, I'm glad you asked. But that's mm. not, um, there's nothing more I can say about it other than flushing your body. You know, just making sure, just like we women take care of our coochies, you know, we need to do the same thing. 
elsewhere. It's a booty hole. And men should do the same thing. I am so for men, you know, I call it booshing. But you can do a enema. I'm just saying, let's be for real. An uh, enema? Yes, clean <laughs> yourself out, you know. Cleanse yourself out. And men should, they should have a product. Like women have, um, what do we have? What is the spray that they that people talk about? FDS. Yeah, the FDS and I all love the other FDS stuff. I FDS spray. Men should use that it makes, too. It makes your coochie smell like flowers oh in gosh. a garden and right. birthday cake. Right. How are we supposed to use that? The same way we use it. Spray Just spray it, it on there. You can spray it on right. your drawers. You got nuts. Spray it on your drawers. Spray it on there. Listen. It's like a deodorant for that. It's just for that. Right. It's just for that. Yeah. yeah. So if you start using yeah. that, your woman would appreciate it. Yes. Believe yeah. it. Yeah. It's like a deodorant Wash for that. What does it spritz. smell like? Any, you could buy different fragrance. Fr- fr- but you said FDS. Yes. Like, you, you make it sound like it's something for women. It is. But men can use it too. Because some of especially some of the... Shouts out to all the big guys. I love you and your bellies, but sometimes they need that FDS spray too. Mm-hmm. For real? Be for serious. They like, they need it. Spread underneath your belly, lift it up, and spread it underneath your balls. Wow. It's Where can I really find good. this FDS? <laughs> <laughs> right next to the tampons. Right next to the tampons? Yeah. And the feminine wash and all that stuff. It works That's if right, I, if I Vince, go play and wash and that, that ass. Right, right, right. It all works. We'll just take a trip and get the products. And then you'll test them you out. You're thinking like, wow, y'all know. for real? No, no for I real. believe y'all. For real. I believe y'all. I don't think y'all bullshitting me. When she gets to that, what's it, gooch? A goo- <laughs> what it what was called again? Gooch. 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 When she oh, gets gooch. to that gooch area and right. you got the FDS spray. Yes. Oh, it's a wrap? It's a wrap. She oh, going man. in. She you, going, she going in. in. You going to be sleep. She going in. You going to be sleeping like a baby. She going in. All right, y'all continue the show. I'm going to be back in a minute. Amanda, you Great balls of flowers. Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness! Really? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Are any guys out there um, able to to chime in and say yes that they use the feminine products? Who's gonna raise their hand and say yes? I do. Ask I do. Question next week, I will. <clears throat> <laughs> I will. It works. Look, Mocha magic. says uh, she told you, telling you to take me to the store. <laughs> Road trip. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, we should have Chief call in because we've been there. So he should be having some feedback for us soon. Who, Chief, you are you there? Him? Yeah, I took Chief to the store to get him some products, but you know, Chief. You got him some FDS? Mm-hmm. For real? Oh, man. He didn't even put me on. <laughs> he didn't even put me on to the FDS. <laughs> man, I want my nuts to smell like roses, too. You know and what birthday I'm cake. And birthday cake, you definitely. <laughs> I want to be able to. I want to be able to run, uh, run to the car real quick and then run back three or four times, but again, and still be able to just wow. But listen, like, oh. for ladies and men, you know, we need to always clean before we spray. You know, don't just be spritzing, be spritzing, and oh, no, oh, yeah. and, sh- no. and shave or wet. So whatever right. you do down right. there. Right. A lot of guys don't feel like they got to do that. And then they, they take room. deodorant they and what? rub it down there. And the, they have deodorant balls down there. Like they have yeah, you can't do that. Arm. You can't do that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. A lot of guys that. put deodorant down there. They really do. I've never done that. And it gets and all on your it. mouth don't and do your it. lips. Don't do it. And then what's the, what's the other term you said? I don't want no nothing in my deodorant. Dirty Sanchez. The Dirty Sanchez with the deodorant be right there. so kim denise so as far as losing that inner freak spark between partners do you think that somebody not shaving or having not taking those extra steps to to appease us as ladies do you think that that hinders our reaction to the men sexually yes because i do not like a man who do not shave Mm-hmm. So I would not try my best to turn you on or get you up or do anything. I'm gonna hold my nose while I suck your dick. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Is wait. there a term for that? Hold the nose while I suck your dick. Wait, a try bone. So, 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 so you're looking for that right there? A door stopper. You looking for somebody like oh a door stopper? I'm gonna hold my nose. Oh my gosh! You're gonna hold your nose while you suck it. What? Like, like that. Oh man! No, why? Why would you do that? <laughs> Microwave looked at it like, "Oh man, do it again." <laughs> yeah, I'm serious. I'm like, wait a minute, that's about to be some some gag action. It might be some, yeah. that might be some serious yeah, gag. Hold your nose, gonna be some serious that's gag hard. action. Hawk. <laughs> 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 that's that hawk action. 
Fuck yeah, God. I like that. I yeah, like that, you like that, man. don't you? Where, where you from? I like that. I'm from Brooklyn. <laughs> Yeah, you sound like it too. Yeah, I'm from Brooklyn. Giving you that Brooklyn sun. Hold your nose. <laughs> hold your nose. Hold your nose and give me that brain. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yo, yo. Me, me, that would bring me back my, the spice. Me and my crew, or a select few of my fellow, we call that um, we call that getting guffed. Getting guffed. Yeah. Snorkel. And the reason why we call it getting guffed, like you, you've seen it in the pornos when somebody's getting like gagged or whatever, and it's really going in, just like. <laughs> <laughs> getting guff, baby. That's what we call getting guff. Down here in Decatur, <laughs> off of Glenwood, we call that getting getting some head. Getting getting, getting some, some head. head. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that shit is hilarious. Getting guff, I'm like getting yo, guff. my nigga, yo, she was guffing the shit out that's of me. A, that's guffing. the New York term, so okay. we need to put that in the Urban Dictionary. Girl. Getting guff. Okay. Is it G-U-F-F-F? Uh-huh. It's, I'm going I'm to tell you the... Um, G-U-F-F. That's what that is, G-U-F-F, but I'm trying to see if something else comes up. It's in here. I'm going to tell you what it's meaning is my term, in my in my head, in my world. Mm-hmm. Getting guff is the sound effects of some spectacular mm-hmm. watery mouth head. Mm. That's right. Yes, basically. But that's, that's basically. not the dish. I don't know what they're saying over there. Yeah. Not yeah, coming up with that, anything. No, because yeah. Devin was totally it got something to do with that, that's ass again. That's something that we came up with on our own. Yeah, mm-hmm. that got something you know, to do with ass. Give it seven again. years; it'll make it in. It'll make it. In <laughs> you just gotta go in there and put it in. Just gotta oh, put yeah? it in. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, let's put it in right now. <laughs> well, I was like, I, the all, I bet you all wrestling. Well, I look great. like your they secretary. Like, they said, "What's getting golf though? Forget all wrestling. Forget all. Delete those. Delete those. This the new definition of getting golf." Shouts out to Bruce Wanye joining hey, the Bruce chat. Wayne. That's my baby. Hey, boo. <laughs> Actually, he, he did a show. Let me see. How many shows ago? Three shows ago. Three shows. He, Have he, you heard that show? He, I know. And I bet it's very nasty. He's such a freak. You damn freak. I told him this morning. <laughs> you are a freak, Bruce Wayne. <laughs> Well, let me see. I have to remember what the show was, but I think he's three shows ago. But yeah, I mean, yeah. but he was pretty forthcoming from a male's perspective. Uh huh. You know, because most of you guys won't say that you will fuck around other men watching. You know. Say what? See. 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 Fuck while somebody, especially while not no guys watching. Especially not no Brooklyn son. <laughs> Brooklyn ain't finna have you behind him watching his ass, son. <laughs> no. Uh, it, it, de- it, it, it depends. On, it depends on the situation here, like. No, no, son. Like, yeah. what do you mean? What kind of watching? <laughs> like at a like at a party or something. Right. Like maybe like maybe group sex. y'all um group sex. Oh group yeah, we sex. good. I don't give a fuck about that shit. Now she can watch you get some gulp. Ain't no nigga watching. They can me. watch you get some gulp. You, you watching some of that other action going? What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He want to call. Bruce want to call in. <laughs> oh my now, They can watch you get some gulp. And what's the other one with the trauma? Uh, I don't want you. I don't want no man watching me get gulp. <laughs> Why not? Why would I want a man to watch oh me get guffed? He's watching a girl and her ashes and her right, skills. Right. And like a pull, porno. You can put your phone up for that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You can put your phone up for that. Don't even sitting there watching me get guffed. Nah, nigga. Like, but wait. You, you, I don't think you heard the show, Mike Ray, but Bruce Wanye did task everyone with getting a selfie stick. And he gave them the assignment. Oh, I still ain't learned about that yet. Well, that what was his is assignment. What is a selfie stick? What do you do? Are we taking pictures of my crotch? Because I could just put the timer on my cell phone and then, you know, ching, ching. I, I got some pictures. Now, I don't need ching, ching. I don't need this. Bruce, do I really need the selfie stick? I mean, look. Look, Microwave. Bow. Yeah. Put the time. <laughs> put the, I can get it done. Put the time on. Pull back some skin, and there you go. <laughs> pull back that skin, and there you go. A picture. So what? let me ask both of y'all this though. Since 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 y'all uh on that tip, y'all y'all drop down and get your eagle on. <laughs> Tell us the um the Atlanta term for what you just said. Do you do you get waxed? Yes. You got that bald eagle. I got that bald uh, eagle. <laughs> <laughs> Down that was a conversation they was that they were saying in one of the Facebook groups about the whole wax thing and the near thing. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna tell you, girls. Tell them. I'm gonna tell them. Now, near is very strong and it works very it well. Is. But you can also go to the dollar store, Dollar Tree, Dollar General, mm-hmm. and they have the same product for one dollar and it's way gentle, no burning. 
And, and it does after. the same exact job. Does it have the after smell that Nair has? Because Nair smells like...